The Federal Executive Council has approved the memorandum presented by the Minister of Works and Housing for the augmentation of the contract for Sokoto Tambual Jega Mekara Road. Minister of Works and Housing Baba Tunde Fashola while briefing the State House media after the weekly cabinet meeting said the contract was seeking an augmentation of 8.39 billion naira which was for price changes essentially between 2012 when the contract was awarded and now. The minister said over 85 kilometers of the road has to be changed from rehabilitation to reconstruction because it has deteriorated from when it was first awarded 12 years ago. The scope of works of the 85 kilometers of, of the road has to be changed now from rehabilitation to reconstruction because it has deteriorated from when it was awarded 12 years ago. So council approved this. And um, just for your information, there are two sections of the road because it comes all the way from Sokoto to Makira. The first section was awarded to Triacta. That section is 296 kilometers. We've completed that. We completed it just recently. Uh, the entire 296 kilometers is now motorable. Uh, about 100 kilometers of the second section, which is the subject of augmentation from Yauri to Makara, has been completed. So we just have about 85 kilometers to go. Meanwhile, the Federal Executive Council did not discuss the issue of the Minister of Communication and Digital Economy, Isa Pantami, whose alleged previous link with Al-Qaeda and Taliban had led to calls for his resignation. Minister of Information and Culture, Lai Mohammed, said the issue was not raised at the meeting. I'm not going to go into the issue of whether government is comfortable or not. I will answer your question directly. It was not discussed at the council meeting. Thank you. Pantami, who was physically present at the meeting, had been embroiled in controversy over his unearthed comments, endorsing both terrorist organizations, has, however, announced that he has renounced the views. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.